for there uh, in Africa, in Asia, sorry, to just build that up. I will get them some uh, colonials. So India would be awesome for that. Okay, you guys on the boat. Let's go from. Let's. L oh, we gotta break that fleet. That's not gonna take as long. Thing is, if I can get Holstein annexed, or at least get them in my sphere, then that gives us Keel. Hmm. Go to go to, to Friedson first. I could potentially do that. I'll have a look later. Christ in West Macedonia. We can't do anything in that. Panjab on access. Sure, we might be going to war with you later. Trump is very fr- Ah! Ha 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 ha! So, no one backed the Ottomans, who are now, I believe, secondary. They are a, ter a third power. They're a levelized nation. So, because no one backed the Ottomans in this, the Greeks automatically got West Macedonia. So they're actually stronger than they were before, which is awesome. Because it just, it just gives us more power, basically. Which is, you know, really, really useful at this stage in the game. Also, what have they got? Is it just commentators? Man of Wars. Wow, they really are not going to win that. Just all reg. So, let's go down here. So let's go and get ready to help, because they're going to move in as soon as this battle's over. Are they trying to land something? Mountaineers unite! In London, the world's first mountain climbers club was founded in 1857. To the peak! Just for like one prestige. Go on, Afghanistan. Yeah, we killed the fleet. Uh, what's that? Spain? Spain. Spain! Who's at War of Java? Okay. <laughs> so we're now blocking off that fleet. Can I actually make a demand of you? Like, I would love it if I could actually make a war goal. <gasps> No! Ah, so close. So close. I liberate Iceland. So who's got Chad Mayer? That's Yeland. Releasing puppets is going to help out the Prussians. I could add you to my sphere, but I'm getting you anyway. Nah, it's not really worth making war goals, just get the peace out of the way. So, 60 or 17. Alright, that's not going to take too long. I mean, we've got them trapped now. We could actually just land at the Schleswig and finish them off. Are you leading the way? You are. Let's go to Copenhagen then. We'll go to Odin's and just carry it straight on. We should be able to help out a ton in this battle. I do like how they actually show both sides, by the way. Like, this is my division, that's theirs. It's not just this way you're deployed. Not a kill, but they can't retreat, so it is a kill. They want to peace out for Iceland acquires Iceland and Greenland, sure. I thought it'd be polar bear. <laughs> I thought it'd be polar bear. Is that over here? Because there's one, it's like you can liberate Jan Mayan. And that just makes me laugh so damn much because it's, it's Jan Mayan. If you don't know what Jan Mayan is, it's the polar bear. It's a joke uh, Paradox made. And it kind of stuck, which is the best bit. Uh, the Morpins, go to Slashburg. You go pick him up in Flamberg. The, Al the Avaldi Congress. The situation in, uh, in the Avaldi provinces has reached a boiling point, and leading members of the Avaldi communities have assembled a national congress to m in Menat. Citing the proud traditions of the Avali autonomy and self-rule, the rights of peoples, and the repeated in injuries suffered under what they refer to as British y the British yoke, the man renewed independence. They about die has been cast. So they, they just want their freedom. They're not getting it, but they want it. I'm going to take any casualties, jeez. Alright, going more up in Chelmsford. And are you guys over in India yet? No, where are you? Well, you're in India. You're making your way down. Oh, God. That's where they are. That's where one of them is. Where are my armies? Ah, there, there's one. Where's the other one? Because there were two damaged ones, weren't they? Yeah, the rest of the Black Watch, they must be moving together. Yeah, they're over. And we are getting a new army set up. What else could we do? 
I think now is the time we do actually want to start getting down the ideological, ideological thought path. Are you the recruitment of the rally point? You're not. You are. So what do you need? Nothing. What do you need? Uh, a lot. You need two cannons and an infantry. You are to San So we could actually do that. Uh, two cannons and an infantry. What do you need? Four cannons and an infantry. Well, let's get the first group sorted out, and then we'll move on to you. Uh, we are getting a new army. A election's coming up. That's always fun. Ends on 1st of July. And now, peace reigns in the Empire again. I do like how our sphere of influence is looking, though. She's getting quite neat. Uh, Keel, how are we looking for you? So, oh. Could I try it? That may get anywhere, but we'll work on too many things at once right now. I think, well, Egypt, we're done. We could just put that down to one. That puts these up faster. Hanover, it's literally just to annoy the Prussians that we're doing this. We have a ton more investment than they do. Jeez. Uh, trade policy. I would like to go with free trade. Yeah, we're being a miles. Never show. Oh, there we go. Organization up. Denmark's soon going to be our sphere. Really, I'm surprised we have not got nitroglycerin yet. Yeah, they're getting ready to just uh, expel us. Or they already can. Oh no, they're trying to ban the embassy. Do you think 65? Yeah. So anytime now... Uh, we're secular. That, that. Let's... Leave it. Let's go throw us out. Okay, so we want to move on to this. Ideological four. I want to get this sorted out, because national imperialism is important. There we go. Front band for a year. I'm going to stop us fighting over it. Uh, telegraph coordination, organization up, army supply up. So we're getting, we're getting decently strong, really. Do I fancy taking on pressure, though? What's your... Your jingoist. So you actually haven't got that strong an army. Oh, wait, wanted. A statewide manhunt has been called in one of our states. As police report that a convicted murderer has escaped from a local prison facility. While unsettling in itself, this news is also brought to our nation's prison system as a public uh, to a public spotlight, fueling a national debate on the issues of crime and punishment. Liberals argue that the escape merely serves as further indictment of the dilapidated and tragic state of our nation's prison system, while conservatives point to na natural constraints on our national budget, and argue that we should not spend the better part of our money on what is arguably the worst of our citizenry. So who do we play in the high strata or the low strata? Such high. There's less rich. Uh, full system, yep. <laughs> Big game hunting. Uh, this one I want to go with prestige. Uh, annoys Sierra Leone a bit. Eh. Leader's gone. Was that John Sabaton? Seaton. Hmm. Wow. 21 from that. That's actually a lot more than I expected. I could help him expand a bit more. Like, take the north? Uh, are we getting any flashpoint attention here? No. Why not? Because you exist. That should technically be a flashpoint. Great power rankings putting it back down. Gotcha. So I need to just annoy you a bit. Like, if I batter the US a bit, it might actually help us out. Ah, that could be useful, actually. And there's a ton of combat ships over here. Why? Alright, go sail back home. My mate will put you in, Cardiff. And you are nearly done. Oh, whoa. What the? Oh, really, game? <laughs> Alright. It's Commerce Raiders. Go pick him up. And pick him up. I could go take Sicily. Because <laughs> Sicilian, Sicily, and British Sicily. Where's your capital? It's in. It doesn't actually say. Hmm. Ascension Spain, usurp position. Why not? We're near it anyway. 
Uh, nice. Navy speed up. There's your capital in Campania. So we could actually take them. Who's this against? Ethiopia. Uh, I, I'm going to take the CB, but I don't, you know, I'm not going to use it. I would love to uh, get national imperialism before we do anything like that. So get on the boat. We'll drop you off here. And then we'll send this group off to Plymouth. Thank you. Uh, let's put a fort here. Let's build up our fort. Let's build up our forts in this state because we're going to need them. In case the French come over, let's build the forts up here as well because we're going to need that. Uh, if Spain is our front line, then we're not really going to need the. Well, we need the fort in Jib. We'd hope to have the fort in Jib. What's this? Iceland. Come on then, Iceland. Uh, Spain's actually in our sphere, so we could actually reasonably just decrease our investment here. Portugal is nearly there, no one's bothering to fight us over it. So really, we're just going to be fighting over uh, Hanover. Which Hanover is actually fair. But there will come a point where they just can't do it anymore. Because they've actually delayed them quite a bit. They actually normally form the German nation by now, or the North German Federation by now, and start the wars with the um, Austrians. But the Austrians actually hold on very nicely. Because I thought they'd have, like, they've got Bavaria. Bavaria is the one that's most likely to become a great power out of the of German miners. And I kind of wish that wasn't the case, but, you know, video games. So Bavaria is, what, ninth in the world? Wow. They are very close to becoming a great power of their own accord. So who could actually knock out the top rankings? Two Sicilies, the Russians. Belgium would be quite easy to do. Russia wants access, no. Um, Stockpile T. USA, we're not going to deal with, because I just don't care about them. Prussia, we need to knock down anyway. Uh, the Russians... Well, to be fair, getting Prussia... Getting Bavaria is going to cause more trouble in the German states, which just stabilizes this region a bit more. Because they're going to be fighting over these guys. Switzerland is 22nd. <laughs> That's not going to happen anytime soon. <laughs> so we could knock out Belgium from the top ranking quite easily. Netherlands, you're not going to recover anytime soon. Let's actually invest in your railroads just because we can. Hanover. I just don't think we're going to see the German nation united, so that's still worth fighting for. I would love to get Kiel. Holstein, sorry. But we have to get him out of the German, the Prussian sphere. Hmm. Just trying to figure the best way to do this. How are you doing down here anyway? You got the... You do, good. But they're part of the British Narcolibs, so we have to be careful of that. So, you need what? One Inf and four Can. One Inf. I can get you three Cannons. That's, to be fair, reasonable. That's more than I was expecting to get. We are over our naval limit, but that will solve itself when we get our new naval bases, which aren't that far away, to be fair. Uh, less than a year. Which, to be fair, on the scale of this game isn't that far away. Though I will admit I'm surprised the Chinese haven't tried to fend us off. Haven't tried to force us out yet. Portugal is now in our sphere. Good. So that's another one. So we've got Iberia on side. That's a uh, this thing. Really, You're doing this again? Doctrine of lapse. Doctrine of lapse was a British policy regarding Britain's Indian subject nations, the princely states. I've stated that any such blah blah blah, we get Travacor. We got Travacor. Okay. I'll just not question that. Uh, let's go for state and government, because this is actually a good one to get. Mission to Civilize is useful, because it helps life rating. We're a bit late getting it, but that's mostly because, you know, we're kind of... You know. So, I think France has it. Over then again, the amount of neighbors we've got, just about anyone in the world could have it. There's a lot of this that we actually need to pay attention to. But we're getting there. Anytime you want to give us an actual glycerin game, anytime, I won't complain. 
Iceland. Love how no one cares about Iceland. <laughs> it's just there. Oh, we got another one, didn't we? Uh, I need to check this out again, don't I? Lowlands. You're overdone. Again. Eastern. Overdone. Wales. You need 1%. I wish you could just automate this. Yeah. And Friesland. Friesland is not core. So I don't think there's many British here. We've got North Germans and Dutch. Okay, we need to... Um, how's the simulation work? Core culture of Assen. Uh, does not belong to the exclusive culture group. One of the following must be true. And those... Nope. Belongs to the exclusive culture yet? Nope. Let's see it up. So we've got plus 20% because it's a core culture of the region. So we're not going to make them convert anytime soon. Still, they're happy otherwise. Hey, you are Protestant. I believe we're Protestant as well. Yeah, we're... Have to get the literacy up. You're on another psalm? Where's this? She went inside India. So we have to get to work in India soon to get these guys converted. Because that would actually help us out a bit. Cause less issues in the long term. We're near the colonial race. That's the annoying bit. So, you need... Oh, it was over in Malta, wasn't it? Yep, it's picking you up. On there. And after that, I'll send you over to Plymouth to get reunited. With your latter half. Why is the asshole screwed up? Thank you. Oh, I'll tell you factory. Sweet. So this shouldn't take long at all. Go to Lincoln. Uh, your fault is not done. You are still greater than that. Why are we losing money? Probably because of all the investments we're making. Because we are buying in a lot of stuff, but these are nearly done. Now we're sitting are coming along. Collectivism. Sea Lane Hunter. And Breach Loaded Rifle Armament. Good. Rush is being an annoying pain in the ass again. Alright, so now you're here. This is what? This is First Army, which is... Thankfully, First Army, this will be the, the 15th Army. Army... Um, what have we got? Um, actually, that could work. No, not the Denmark Guard. Um, Danish Guard. There we go. You go to Salisbury, and then we'll work out where you go later. You are meant to be replaced. Whoa, you've lost more. Wait, 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 wait. She wants to be part of this. That explains a lot. <laughs> so if we can get one more t artillery piece, we can finish this off. Good thing we've got more artillery piece. Belgium wants access, don't care about you. Okay, so where do we go from here? I guess we just find, wait for things to happen again. What's this? British West Indies can become a core. A state. So that's going to help us out a lot. Really, most issue the British have with their states is that they're just so damn expensive to turn to states. Uh, colonies, rather. So, <laughs> problem with their colonies is that it costs so much to turn to states. That worked better. So you really have to be careful because they can like really backfire on you. What's going on here anyway? Is this still another thing? Yep, Columbia's still on a sphere. Nice. I'm tend to work on the UNSCA. <laughs> tend to work on Mexico. Uh band from yeah, yeah, yeah. we always get banned from there. We're just getting tons of these now, we're getting one nail base up. But you can see it really does just stack up quick. Like, we're getting one state, and it's leading to another state, it's leading to another state. I believe the most expensive state in the game is like 3,002 points, or something like that. And that's after all the conversions are done, after you've got all the things, sorry, that I believe it's not Gibraltar, is it? But it ca you can actually effectively have everything in the game converted with enough time. The problem is literally just that you've got to take the time. 
And it doesn't actually cost anything to turn into a state, it's just that you, you know, that. Punjab! You're one we're going to go to war with anyway, but we haven't got the infamy for that. I'm not at the point where I have nationalism imperialism. Why are we still losing money? Bavaria Socialists. What's this?